Okay, guys, it's the next day out here. Um, kind of show you what we need to get done before we start bringing in the slag. Um, I got to take this gate down and the feeder, or at least get the gate out of the way so I can scrape all that out. And then I'll have to do some hand shoveling just to get it away from, uh, you know, from the barn there and around the posts and stuff like that. Then we can start bringing the slag in. So we got a lot to do. So let's get to work. I'm gonna go ahead and dig all this out by hand. Throw you guys on some time lapse. All right, guys, I got it all cleaned out right there. So if I can get in there and drag all this out and move this barrel, it's full of water. So let's get at that and uh, see how things turn out here. All right, guys, I got all that shoveled away from the areas that I needed to. So I'm gonna go ahead and do a final cleanup on all this. Uh, and then we'll evaluate it and see how much slag we need to put in. I got 40 ton of it, so hopefully that's enough. But I mean, our objective is to build this up right here. So the water quits coming in this way. So we're gonna eventually put a gutter up there and uh, hopefully that'll take care of it. So I'm gonna get on the machine, clean this up, and then we'll start moving some slag. All right, guys, I got it all cleaned out of here. Um, I'm kind of kind of let it set for maybe an hour, and I'm gonna go ahead and level off that stuff. It's kind of clumpy. Get that back dragged. Let this dry out a little bit, and then we'll start bringing the slag in. But I don't know if you can tell in the video, but it's it's low right there. But the water comes off this eave, you know, and just runs. So our idea is to build it up high and gently slope it out past and then uh, I'll put fascia covering on this fascia board here and then we'll put a gutter but we'll bring the water back that way and I have a drain in front of the barn I can tie into and that'll help keep some of the water out of here because in the winter time this gets so muddy that the horses end up getting up to their almost knees so hopefully this slag will tighten it up a little bit and it'll take care of everything so i'm gonna go ahead and uh get this back drug here and then maybe it'll tighten up enough i can start bringing some slag in 
So I hope you guys are enjoying this video. Uh, it's probably going to be a long one, but uh, you know, it's it's what uh, it's what we're doing today. I guess I don't know. <laughs> guys um i've got it pretty close to where i want it i'm gonna put a little bit more out that way drag it out that way so the water at least runs that direction uh to get it out of here if you know any water is coming down like i said we're gonna put gutters up i can do a little fill in here and then uh and then uh we'll do a little bit we got a horse stall to fill in but i think it looks all right you know uh i gotta get a tamper and we'll tamp this stuff and it'll be as hard as the rock so i'm gonna go ahead and get this straightened out a little bit and then i'll catch you guys in a little bit all right guys it's all done i think it'll be good enough i mean we run a tamper on this and it'll it'll uh harden up pretty good but the next uh chore on the list is now i gotta move all of that over there so that's all the manure that come out of here so let's let's see we got them in got the cows in march and we just took them in october so march to october that's what they produced it's uh quite a bit <clears throat> so let's uh get that moved over there we'll straighten all this up put some slag in right here so it doesn't puddle up anymore and uh hopefully it does the trick so let's get at moving this stuff
All right, guys. I think I'm gonna call it a day. We got everything cleaned out of there. I'm just gonna do a little bit of cleaning right there and put some slag in there, and I, that's about it. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, we've got a lot more stuff coming up here, and uh, you know it's 80 degrees today, and it's November, so it's awesome. So we're trying to take advantage of everything. Uh, I'm gonna finish this last stall here, so that'll be a video. A few other things I got to get done here, and then. Uh, I just posted a uh, full video of restoration on that barn, so I hope you guys like that one. But, like I said, I'm signing off here for today, and I'll catch you guys later. Thanks.